What? That's sweet. 7120, 6440. I had 680 pounds. There's been a price increase. Price increase. That's what I'm talking about. All right, I'm here at the farm to pick up some scrap metal. Cool. Man, those, <laughs> those are some old brake shoes. With drum brakes, they were called shoes back in the day. Wow. Back in the day. It's a bit windy today, but it's warm. Frip. Definitely old school. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of picking up old fencing. But, uh, he's a cool dude. So, I'm gonna scrap this. metal it is wow <laughs> is there an easy way of doing this that's actual barbed wire dude Yeah, all it takes is one little piece to get caught up. Yeah, that's barbed wire, bro. can't see it too well like it blurs into the background huh. probably shouldn't be stepping on a well huh <laughs> oh, yeah don't come apart Last piece. Huh. Now, albeit small, there's a chance they don't want my uh, my scrap because it's fencing. And fencing is, it tangles. So we'll see. Wow, 6720. So <laughs> that's like 200 pounds, maybe. Good. 
6720. Oh, that's that one guy from Geneva that does a bunch of scrap. Yeah, this guy was in a video of mine, I don't know, a month ago or so. Pardon the noise. <laughs> hey, that's Glenn. You know what? We're going to say hi to Glenn first. What's up, man? They're gonna cut me open December the 4th. Dude, I heard they you've already been cut open twice. What's up with that? They're gonna do two of them at one time. Two two in the chest? No. Well. One in the chest. Right. They're gonna go under my arm. Okay. Okay. Do my blood. Okay. They're gonna do both at the same time. Then you're gonna be the six million dollar man. I'll feel like the six million. <laughs> yeah, this stuff is done. Yeah, it's good to see old Glenn. If there was a way I could like just pull it all out at once, wouldn't that be great? Hey. Why? No. I'm not getting any of it out at once. When I was 18, I worked for Allen Drilling Company in Las Vegas. We used to use those to just drill holes for whatever. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. So I did get hurt loading it. I don't want to get hurt unloading it. What's up, man? That's yeah, already tangling. it let loose getting there
reminds me of sticker bushes in Las Vegas. Left, and I'll scooch my way to the scale. so they can see me. It is so nice. No jacket, no nothing, man. You gotta make some burgers tonight or some mushroom burgers. <laughs> the teenagers are um, they're barbecuing ribs. Oh, really? Right now? Yeah, yeah. Hey, they are not playing. They aren't. They they got <laughs> this rack of ribs was so big it wouldn't fit in the freezer. Really? <laughs> yep. Nice. So I speak the truth. I think so, unless they eat it all up before I get home. They might. So they're grilling them, grilling them though? Yeah, they put it on the grill, yep. Yeah. Right. Uh, all right. <laughs> Thank you, Katie. I'll see you later. <laughs> see you later. Thanks, God. You are it. <laughs> God, what's it like to be God? <sighs> Maybe I don't want to know. <laughs> Thank you for loving me. Thank you for loving us. Thank you for caring. Thank you for making. Hmm. Thank you for making us, especially in your image. Hmm. In the name of Jesus, amen. All right, so what do you got? 20 bucks for... 260 pounds of fencing. Ooh, not that kind of fencing. Well, it's not really on the curb, but next to a dumpster is close enough. Yeah, this one's kind of rusted up. That's a lot of sediment coming out. 
just falling out of it. Digging into this plastic, it's not scooting like I want it to. <laughs> Come on, dude. Like that. That's what I'm talking about. That's old school too. That's a KitchenAid. Wow, they got all kinds of scrap for me. <coughs> Beyond a cool. Is that a bread maker? Seriously, this is like scrap Christmas. This thing's heavy for a dryer. Yeah, I might as well write it up. Because now that I think about it, we should put that stuff in the dryer. Yeah. 
barbecue and a bicycle at the curb. That's a nice bike, actually. A Nishiki. Interesting. That's a good old fashioned 10 speed. Wow, light as a feather. This thing is too heavy. tank in there but it doesn't This close. Hmm. Yes, please. That's aluminum, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> so that's probably gonna get taken up at the house. Not too shabby. Not at all. So I'm gonna take this off and then we'll pick up this operation in the morning. Good morning. I still see Venus for a little while. So for another couple of months the Venus Venus the planet the second planet from the Sun will be uh, in our morning sky and then it'll go on the other side of the Sun we won't be able to see her for a while I took the bicycle off I took the aluminum uh, lounge chair off and let's go find stuff on the curb now that's a beautiful sunrise and some beautiful scrap That is no joke. Yeah, there's some wheels on it. <laughs> this looks a bit dangerous. <laughs> I bet this looks so silly from the homeowner's perspective. I'm up to my chin with scrap. <clears throat> yeah, this is a uh, hundred pounds at least. Maybe more. Hmm, what's the best thing to do here? I'm thinking 
straightforward here without falling off the back of the truck. Yes. Is it too much? Maybe. Perfect. Now I can't. Oh no. I can't reach it. Noticed yesterday, I forgot to wear my boots. That's rare. That is a rare thing. But yeah, yesterday after I, so yesterday I went out scrapping in the morning and then I edited, edited the video and then I went, went out scrapping again but after I edited the video, I took a shower and then I put on my regular shoes and I just forgot. That should work. Yeah, I just forgot to put my boots on. And then I, I was at the, uh, at the farm and I'm loading up the scrap and I'm looking down, you know, cause these are steel toed boots and these boots are as comfortable as shoes. They're, it's like wearing, it's like being barefoot. These boots are great. They're totally comfortable. So, I just spaced. <laughs> nice. All right here. No, that's not gonna work. We're not gonna work either. That might work. What is that? A barbecue on the curb. That's a big boy too, that's a smoker. So heavy I can't even pull it out with one hand. Really dude. big train I can, I can hear it chugging along all right baby bro yeah I'm so excited so probably straight across with it so kind of a reach Yeah, that, 
That's a big heavy tree and I can feel the base in my feet of that train. man all right hmm. Let's see just one truck back there it looked like a I think they call it a van trailer a trailer that has like a top to it they're back there dumping I'm gonna say we're decently heavy so 7200. No. 7,100. Hmm. Hey. Man, trailer moved. That's good. Uh oh, here comes a train. I gotta air up my tires. Sometimes the cold mornings makes it, um, yeah, the pressure in the tires aren't as much because it's cold air is has less density. I hear somebody. Scoot it out of the way. Hope I'm not running over anything. Stop right there. Give myself plenty of working room. spots here. enough working room.
Thank you, sir. morning workout <laughs> it's not really exercise it's just it's not a workout it's just work if I did that for I don't know an hour probably would be much more healthy for me Green light. No. Hey. I'll, I'll text you the I'll text you the address right now, okay? Okay, bye. Good morning, Michael. Good morning, Kyle. What is up? Not much. Um, um, um you're here early today. I am. Yeah, the truck got full. Plus, I'm uh, I'm gonna do a little bit more running around, and uh, just in case I'm gonna find a refrigerator or something, I want to have an empty truck. Hey, hey, what's up, man? It didn't come up, man. Oh, there it is. It's slow. Your computer's just waking up. Right, for real. I'm just waking up. No. You've probably been up since 4.30 working out. 4.30 trying to get back to sleep? <laughs> no. Thanks, man. Uh, one, two, three, four. Sweet. Have a great day. Hey, man. See ya. Thank you. Thank you. God. Thank you for the mornings. Thank you for bright, sunny mornings. <sighs> I like this, God. I like when others participate. God, let me participate in others' lives uh, more because sometimes I think I'm on the selfish side of the scale. I don't want to be that God. Help me with that in the name of Jesus. Amen. All right. $54. What? That's sweet. 7120. 6440. I had 680 pounds. There's been a price increase. Price increase. That's what I'm talking about. $54.40. Sign me up. I am not done scrapping. There's stuff out here. It's probably just easier picking up. Put it in the back of the truck. <laughs> scrap just wants to argue 
This table, probably not. A pizza? Yes. A pizza. A pizza scrap. this it's a robot of some sort but I will take these cables no what kind of robot is this I have no idea what this is no clue I do know this is steel, hence the rust. Bicycle for the bike couple. scrap right there. I was thinking, like, should I just pick it up? My shoulder says, nope. Try it. Wow. Yeah, thank you. You moved him for nothing, huh? Yeah. <laughs> this might be the nicest day ever in November. All right, so this stuff is, wait a minute. I kind of like these, but that's not really what I'm after. I'm after the helium steel. I'll bet that garbage man grabbed that. This guy a while, a while back gave me a barbecue. Thank you, it's all yours. Yeah, thank you, I appreciate it. I remember the barbecue last time. Oh, yeah. yeah, thank you. <laughs> that was cool. Here's my idea. I'm gonna go grab that other bike and take the bike that's in the truck and that other bike to the bike couple and then go hit the scrap yard. Yeah, this one. Get into my truck. <laughs> Just grateful it's light. The two pieces of scrap that I it. I keep forgetting to put the back of my truck. Yeah, it has gotten so warm. This hoodie is going away. <laughs> this guy just stopped. He saw the scrap sign. Said, "Hey, got some stuff." So we're gonna set up an appointment for tomorrow.
getting all feisty. I like this bike. As a 10 speed with thin tires, and it does have the, those, you know, kind of like ram horn type handlebars. I'll bet this thing is fast and comfortable. All clear. I'm hoping for 200 pounds. Maybe not. See, I was uh, 6440 um, last time coming out. <laughs> 6,620. All right, We're right there. That's not a good sound. What was that? Well, if it was just rocks or something I was running over. Yep. Okay. We're good. Climbing in there. Those are magnets. Let me see uh, the other scary hand. Clutch. Whoa, yeah, I got to go around. So 6620 weighing in, I think 6440 I'll be weighing out, I guess. Sixty four, sixty. So that's a sixty four, sixty five. Maybe two are. I don't know. It matters at what point did they um, read the scale because it fluctuates. That's why it's only at twenty pound increments because it just it fluctuates with a bouncing onto the scale. Hello, Katie. How are you I'm good. I was glad to see a price increase this morning. All right. Thank you. All right. Thanks. I'll see you later. Yep. Thanks again, God. 
I know it says that uh, in your word for us to to continually to pray. Pray without ceasing, it says. Hmm. So I guess talking to you, there is no there is no amen to, to complete a prayer. It's just a constant prayer, constantly communicating with you. God, help me hear you. Um, I know it says in the Bible that it's, uh, it's a still and small voice. Um, help me hear that. Would you amplify your words uh, through the Holy Spirit in me? I need that. Amen. All right, $12. Yeah, 160 pounds. Yeah, I was hoping for 200. $12 and 80 cents. Thanks for hanging out with me. You are awesome.